Hello everyone, my name is Cameron Barr and I'm here to show you very quickly about our new JFacebook uh, SDK wrapper uh, for Joomla. Okay, and essentially what it is, it's a, it's a quick and easy way to enable SE, um, SSO and uh, quick registration uh, on your site, uh, your Joomla powered site. So the best way to show you how to do this um, is just to do it. Okay, so why don't we, why don't we go ahead and do that. Um, we're going to install it on uh, CameronBar.com very quickly, and I'm already logged into the back end. So let's go to install. We're just going to install the package very quickly. Let's find it here. There it is. Okay. We're going to upload and install it. Okay. N and now it's installed. But we have to do a couple of things. We have to configure it. Now, this package assumes that you already have a uh, Facebook developers account and that you've deployed an application on facebook.com I'm gonna take uh, and I've already done this so I'm gonna take uh, my API key and we're gonna go find the plugin that we have to do it's the distributed uh, distributable client library okay and that's just the wrapper for the the new Facebook uh, PHP SDK we're gonna go in here and I'm gonna put my my API key right in there come back and get my API secret or my app secret doesn't want to doesn't want to do it okay we'll put it in the secret box okay and then I get my my app ID there we go let me put that there there's some other debugging features and whatnot, but we're not going to worry about those for right now. And we need to we need to publish this. Okay, so let's do that. Okay, now we have to publish two more. One is the uh, authentication plugin, and that obviously does the uh, uh, authenticating against against the Facebook API or the new Graph API, and the system plugin, which helps take care of some namespace stuff and and uh, just does things that so you don't have to do them and we'll publish that as well. Okay. Now we have to publish the module. Okay, and there it is. Um, and we have to pick a position for it. Now in here you can you can uh, uh, customize what you want the button to say. So I'm going to say login to cameronbar.com. Pretty easy. And I am going to put it I'm just going to leave it on the on the left side. I'm going to enable it. Now, here's the page as it is right now. I'm just going to refresh that to see where we are. And there we are. I've got my login to Facebook, uh, uh, login to Cameron Bar button, and that's a Facebook button. You might want to make it a little smaller so all this is on one line. Um, and then I'm just going to click login to Facebook. Then you get the permission box, request for permission. Um, the Joomla plugin, it uses the email as the principal map, So and we need that. And I think all you Joomla uh, administrators know that. So uh, we need that, and without it, they can't they can't join. Uh, and I think that's fair. And we just click allow, and voila, there I am. I'm not only am I logged in, but I am registered now. Where is it? Here I am. That's me. Okay. So I hope you uh, I hope you get some use out of it. It's a quick and easy way for uh, Joomla powered sites to take advantage of of the Facebook Connect, uh, new Facebook Connect uh, uh, API graph. Uh, again, my name is Cameron, and you can reach us at uh, magneticmerchandising.com, and you can, you can get your own copy of the, uh, uh, of the package there. Have a great day. Bye now.